Hi guys, today's video is on the look I have right now. If you haven't subscribed, go and do so now. And if you want to see how I got this look, then keep watching. Okay, so first shade I'm going in with is Chickadee by Makeup Geek. And I'm going to use my Sigma E40 brush for this. I'm going to place Chickadee all over my lid. Once again, concentrating most of it on my upper, <laughs> upper, on my upper lid. But I'm gonna cover the whole eyelid as well and bring it up pretty high, but not all the way to the brow bone because I'm going to be using another lighter shade there. A little bit more, and I'm gonna go in again my upper lid and I'm doing circular motions in a windshield wiper motion as well okay next I'm going to go in with what is this shade also makeup geek and it's mango tango and I'm going to use my morphe m433 for this is that what I used? Yeah. So this one is going to go right under Chickadee. In the crease, but I'm going to blow it out. And I'm going to drag it out a little bit to give my eye more of an open and larger look. And I should have not, but... It is what it is. I will just blend it out. Bringing it all the way in as well to the inner corner of my eye. And like I said, I'm just dragging it out a little bit on the outside of my eye. And you just keep on blending it fade. I'm gonna go back to my Sigma E40 and Chickadee since I overdid it with a Mango Tango. And I'm going to blend that a little bit more up here because I did not want to lose my Chickadee. You still wanna see that orangey shade come through. And I just locked up, oh, here we go. And again, go back, no extra product, blend this out. All right, that looks pretty good. I'm going to take Beaches and Cream, also Makeup Geek, and I'm going to highlight my brow bone with this. Give it a little lift. Going back to my Sigma E40, no extra product. This is the brush I use for Chickadee. And let's touch this one up over here. All right. So the next shade I'm going to be using is goddess it's a beautiful shade and i'm taking my sigma e60 and i'm going to place that on my lid i'm going to bring it all the way up to the crease Now, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Infallible in Amber Rush, and I'm going to pat that on top of Goddess, just to give it a more metallic-y look. These two shades together are freaking amazing. 
And I'm going to do this with my finger because I always find that these types of shadows should go on with your finger to bring out the most metallic out of them. You see that? My eye just completely lit up with this. I'm gonna go back to my Morphe M433 if I can find it. Yep, it's right here. And this is where I had the Mango Tango on. And blend that. And yes, I decided to do another talk through. Not because I'm comfortable with it already but because I feel I need to get comfortable with this talk through stuff. Okay, for under my lash line, I'm going to go with all the same shades that I've already used. So I'm gonna start with Chickadee and I'm gonna place Chickadee pretty far down because I don't wanna lose the shade. I want it to be visible. So I'm going to go into my lash line, but I'm going to bring it quite a bit down. Like so. And now, and I was using a Morphe M432 and I have another Morphe M432 and I'm going to take Mango Tango. And I'm going to place this closer to my lash line. And keep it as close to my lash line as possible. And going back to my other Morphe M432, the one I had Chickadee on. And I'm going to add a little bit more of Chickadee. because it kind of disappears under the mango tango. Okay, that's it. Uh, let's see, I'm going to go in with a little bit of this goddess and I'm gonna place goddess in the center of my lower lash line. That's good. And now I'm gonna go back to the Amber Rush, the infallible one from L'Oreal. And I'm going to place this, let me see. I'm gonna take my Sigma E30. And I'm gonna place this in my, what is this? My inner tear duct area. That's it, you guys. I'm going to put mascara and my lashes on, and I'll be right back. Okay, so on the lips today, I went with this Essence lip liner. It's called In The Nude. And a Smashbox lipstick, and it's called Honey. I hope you enjoyed the, the talk through. Again, I am not that comfortable doing it yet, but I'm trying, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe. Also follow me on my other um, social media sites, my Instagram, my Twitter, my Snapchat, and even Pinterest. So thank you so much for watching, you guys. Until next time. Hugs and kisses. Bye.